Hey, well, boy, howdy, boys and girls, men and women of all ages and walks of life. Welcome once again to this play inside of the garage. Today uh, is Saturday, and I'm going to bring a little blue Saturday to you with uh, my interpretation of some Albert Collins kind of style. Um, this is just one of his many styles, but uh, and, uh, forgive me, Albert, for playing your stuff wrong if I do. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I had the... Uh, uh, fortune, a good fortune of seeing him many years ago in uh, Ashland, Oregon. And he was not just a great guitarist, but he was a crazy uh, entertainer. He had a guy that followed him around. He had like a hundred foot guitar cable. He'd go out in the audience and walk all around. And this is a long time before people fo were falling backwards into an audience, you know. These guys, these old guys started it all. Anyways, guys. I'd like to thank you all for uh, subscribing to my channel. I have more subscribers. I woke up today and there was a couple more. So I'm inching up all the time and I really appreciate that. And it's because I hope and I think that you guys are sharing the videos with your friends, tell them about it. Guys that like guitar making, building, playing, uh, amplifier stuff. Uh, anyways, uh, that's a lot of advertising for one day. But anywho, uh, he had a couple, Albert did, had a couple of uh, quirks that uh, most players don't have. One is he almost always used a capo whenever I saw him, and it was usually on C. It might have been other ones, like a D once in a while, but it was almost always in C when I saw him. And he also supposedly tuned his guitar to a minor key. So I don't know what bearing that had on it, but uh, he was very, very unique. And uh, I want to run number 62 for you here today and um, just have a good time. And once again, I thank you for um, watching the, my videos and, and enjoying and sharing them with your friends. So let's plug this darn thing in and see if we can't get some uh, Albert Collins style and C for you. Tune up your guitars, plug them in, let's have some fun. I'll do my best. That's pretty cool. He probably didn't do that. <laughs> Anyways, guys, number 62 for your listening and dining pleasure on this blues Saturday. Uh, blues, hopefully as much as I can in the key and in the style of Albert Collins. And if you want to hear real blues styling, make sure and check out Leonard Griffey Blues on the YouTube because he's got the styles. He's got them all. So go and see him, okay? Thanks. <laughs>
right, folks, a little Albert Collins kind of style. There's a bunch of my stuff in there because I never had studied him, but, you know, I try to study a little bit of all of the blues greats, and uh, he was really something, as you noticed, I didn't do it as often as I should have, but he usually used his thumb and, and all of his fingers, but a lot of times just his index finger, he would be going like that, and man, what a player he was. Anyways, guys, once again, thanks for watching the channel. Please like and subscribe. Uh, share the video with your friends. I think that's what gets me more subscribers. I'm working away on that Telecaster and it's getting close to being ready to be put together another couple weeks and uh, I should be putting it together. I'm putting the last coats of oil on it today and tomorrow and I think after that we'll be ready to let her dry up real good and then polish it out and start making it sound good. Anyways guys, once again, thanks for watching the videos. Leave me comments. I will see you in the next video, and don't forget to pray for your country, pray for your friends that need medical attention, pray for the world. Our thoughts and our prayers need to go up to the Father, and they will be heard. I'll see you guys later in the next video. Bye-bye. The Red Barn Strat.